This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com. Lag Ba'omer is a very unusual day on our calendar. Traditionally, we know Lag Ba'omer is a day that commemorates the fact that the 24,000 students of Rabbi Akiva stopped dying. But why would we celebrate that they stopped dying? You know why they stopped dying? Because they were all dead. There was no, nobody left to die. Is that cause for a celebration? If anything, we should fast, we should mourn. Lag Ba'omer should be a day of mourning. We're celebrating that they stopped dying. If there would have been Talmidim who survived, perhaps we could celebrate that they stopped dying, but there were no survivors. All 24,000 students of Rabbi Akiva passed away. What kind of celebration is this? Asks the Pri Chadash, Reb Chizkiyahu Di Silva. There are a number of answers that are given to this question, but there is a secret answer, which is not so well known, given by the Rama Mipano, Reb Menachem Azari Opano. And he reveals to us a great side, a great secret. And that is, in fact, not everybody died. There was one survivor. There was somebody who the decree was upon, and God spared that one great Talmud Chacham, that from him <coughs> the Torah was regenerated and resuscitated. You know who that survivor was? Rabbi Akiva. Rabbi Akiva's students passed away, but the decree was also on Rabbi Akiva. He survived! And through Rabbi Akiva, we have Torah today, because then Rabbi Akiva went to the south and regenerated the Torah. So the secret of Lag Ba'imer is that the students of Rabbi Akiva stopped dying one short of the great master of Torah himself, somebody who in certain regards was perhaps even on a higher level than Moshe Rabbeinu. Moshe Rabbeinu reached the 49th level of wisdom. There are indications Rabbi Akiva even reached the 50th level. That's the secret of Lag Ba'imer. The Rebbe of the Rashbi, Rabbi Akiva, survived. That's the celebration of Lag Ba'imer. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.